Hi everyone, uh, Callan is away for Easter, so it's just me this week. Uh, I'm going to be doing a lot of admin stuff, but I also wanted to hit the road. I've got a bunch of backpacks in the back of the car just in case, um, but I'm going to be driving around finding maybe some new places to source stuff from, so I'm outside Office Works now. I'm going to go inside and talk to their management and see what I can do. Uh, still waiting to hear back from Kmart. There's a couple other stores that I've uh, had emails back and forth with that I'm going to go and see today. Uh, I'm going to try and find some little $2 stores and stuff as well. They might have random things that we can get. A bit more of an admin week, like I said, but here we go. First stop, uh, office works. The backpacks that we did in New South Wales, we actually had uh, a lot of first aid kits in them. The reason why I stopped putting them in is they're quite expensive. Um, even these are still sort of five to eight dollars. But we're gonna go to a few two dollar stores today and we'll see what we can find. This is why I want to ever talk to Office Works. They've got things like band-aids, hand warmers, hand sanitizers, stuff like that. If they've ever got that while it's on sale, that will be good for us. This is the reason why a lot of you wanted me to come here for the backpacks so they're the same price as the kmart ones they're about the same in terms of like size stuff like that so they eight dollars but i have a talk to them see what we can do all right uh office works was a little unfortunate we pretty much got palmed off uh the manager said they were too busy to even come out from out the back it's pretty dead in there so it was a little surprising but uh yeah i spoke to a staff member asked the uh, to speak to a manager uh they asked why i sort of explained why i'm there um and, and the reason why and then they came back and said the manager's too busy uh and they can't speak to us so that's a little unfortunate but they gave me an email so i'll email through i think things like this and conversations like this work a little bit better face to face but it is what it is so office works we'll send an email we'll see how that goes uh on to the next one so i'm actually on the way to the post office and uh there's a gentleman sitting outside the supermarket Hey Maddie, me and my community mate, we actually build backpacks for people that are on the street. So there's like toiletries, hand warmers, a um, few shirts and stuff like that. Would that help you at all? Yeah. Yeah, yeah no worries Maddie. So I'll give this to you. Yeah. What I also do is I, I don't give out money or anything like that. Okay. But what I do is I, I offer people anything you want for lunch. So if there's something that you feel like they haven't eaten for a while, I'll go and get you whatever you want for lunch, mate. Uh, I'm not good. I, I don't I'm good. I'm okay. I'm all good. Thanks. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm happy with this one. Okay, well there, there's some snacks and stuff in there as well, matey. So everything in there is for you. There's a bunch more clothes and stuff as well, mate. Okay, thank okay you. no worries, mate. My name's Ryan anyway. Yeah. It's nice to meet you, bud. Yeah. Nice to meet you, mate. All right, you, you be safe, all right? Yeah. He uh, said he didn't want anything food-wise, but it's pissing down rain. And I'm gonna be honest, there's a charcoal chicken place right there. So I'm gonna get him some food. He can keep it for later or not, so. Hi, mate. Can I just get a, um, uh, Half chicken, okay. and I'll just get like a small potato bake. Yeah. All right. Bottle of coke, half chicky, some potato salad. It's all warm. Hey, matey. I know you said you didn't want any food, brother, but I got you some stuff anyway. Right. So there's a half chicken, some potato salad, and stuff in there. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks there's some socks and stuff in there as well, matey. So everything, everything's for you. So all right, mate. You have a good one, okay? Yeah, yeah. It's cool, <laughs> eh? All right, mate. You have a good one, okay? Thank you. Some of the people that we meet in this, you know, like you look at that guy then, like his, his happiness levels were off the chart. When I came back around in the corner, he's going through the backpack and he was so happy, right? He had the biggest smile on his face, you see, like, I like this shirt, you know, like, and that's what it's all about to me, so. so the guy's sign outside said he needs 45 bucks for accommodation. Now, as you guys know, I don't give out money, but when I get back out there, if he's still out there, I'm going to... Uh, this is where I need to start stopping myself because I probably gonna stop doing this. But I'm gonna ask how far away the place is, make sure he's got ID, and uh, if he does, I'll offer to pay and take him there and pay for your night's accommodation. So I'll see what he says. Hey brother, I just wanted to ask, so you need $45 for accommodation, yeah? Yeah, yeah. How, how far away is the place where you get accommodation for $45? In public house. Is the public house far away? Uh, as per the... If you want to come with me, I can take you there and I'll pay for it. If it's $45, if we go there, I'll pay for it. And you've got ID and stuff? Yeah. Because a lot of the times they won't let you stay there unless you have ID. Have you got ID? Yeah, I have. Okay, yeah. If, if you want, mate, I'll, I'll, I'll pay for it. Yeah, you're going to give me number, I'm going to call... Yeah, I can give you my number, yeah. but the, the problem is i, I got to do work stuff soon, so I can take you there now if you want to. Uh, I'm over here. Yeah, Are you sure? Because yeah. I'll pay for the accommodation for you, I don't mind. Yeah, I, I, I've got it today, I think, brother. Alright, so, yeah, no worries, mate. Okay, okay, you have a good night, alright? I think the situation there was, the, the area that I'm in right now, because I have to go to a post office, it's quite a nice area. 
and he probably gets looked after a fair bit outside that shops. So I think he genuinely probably did want money for accommodation, but again, you guys know my rule, I don't give out money. But I think he didn't want to leave the area then, and he wanted to stay there and sort of get as much money as he could, which I understand, right? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna hold that against him. He asked for my number, because um, again, I assume he wants to, to, to sort of stay there until he can get as much as he can. Unfortunately, this is not close to where I live, so I can't really drive home and then come back and drive him there. So we tried, it's all we can do. Maybe I'll see that guy again though next time I have to come to the post office. He seemed like a pretty level head to do it, so maybe we'll sit down and have a bit more of a conversation with him, uh, take him to lunch and maybe ask him some questions about how he got there and stuff like that. Okay, so I'm back home now. Uh, I don't have the mic plugged in, so if it sounds a little weird, sorry about that. A lot of people have suggested this site. I've been very against it for the most part, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, I'm on a website called Timu. I heard it's a bit of a bit of potluck <laughs> what we might end up with. Seven packs of wet wipes, got 10 of them. A uh, bunch of beanies, 20. The foldable water bottles. They've got these backpacks that are about $6 each. I've been to Officeworks, obviously Kmart's normally where we get them from. Uh, we've got these six packs of male boxes that are $15. A uh, bunch of hair ties for the ladies' backpacks. We got these little dissolvable hand soaps that might be good. So I've got like they're 50 to 100 packs. We got quite a few of the 100 packs. Uh, we got the ponchos. These are 30 packs of socks. So I got a few of those. Uh, gloves. They didn't have many sizes left. Uh, boxes of the hand warmers. So we got a bunch of those. And uh, so that'll be a total of 538. Look, the stuff that I normally buy is from the brands that are cheaper anyway, because again, I, I spend a lot more than I raise doing the Project Panda stuff. Um, a few more things I'm probably going to add to this, then I'll do the order. We'll see how it goes. I'm hoping Timu isn't as bad as some people have said, and then a lot of people have been suggesting it as well, so wish me luck.